the first position, the, the first uh, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and us. So we, can we can come back easily. But from here, I'm, I'm going to employ the supporters to go to the, uh, uh, the team, go to the training grounds, talk to the players, because I understand that the players, somebody, a devil in the club, has divided, he has, he has succeeded in dividing the front of the supporters. The Christian supporters are not playing for the Muslim supporters. The Muslim supporters, uh, the Muslim players are not playing for the Christian players. And that is why the club is, is getting, not getting the results. We are going to unite them and let them understand that they are playing for their contract, they are playing as professionals, and they are playing for the supporters. We are going to get, put them together. It is the board. So we demand explanation on all these things. We demand explanation on all this and go and see house of folk training like orphans. A whole Accra house of folk. You go to the training grounds and they, they train like orphans. Why? We are tired. We are tired. The lies has just become too much. The lies are too much. My humble appeal to Togbe as a brother. My name is Shamu and my simple appeal to Togbe is if he goes home today to sleep, you should wake up at 3 o'clock, done. And, and just sit down and look back, 11 years back to now. The money that he has spent on House of Hope, the two board members that he's been following, especially Alaji Akambi, that he's been following, what profit has he gained from the club? How much has he spent in the club? How much has he got, gotten from the club? And how much has he lost from the club? If he's, he's a listening person for the past 11 years, since he took over from the club, he should sit back and think, what's the way forward for the club? What has he done? And what has he gained from the club? The compound interest that he's been given to the club, has he gotten it to now? Has he gotten it to now? Look at the environment, the secretary. He has painted it, but it doesn't attract anything. He should sit down and think, 11 years, what have I done for the club? Look at the bus. A new bus from Star Life Assurance, or, or Star Edison Assurance. Was he able to get a bus for House of Hope? Go to the secretariat, enter inside, and see what is there. So I'm telling him, he should rethink. For me, the board should be dissolved. Nyao Nyao Tanako came in into Hasefo from what? A revolt. And asked, since then, the, this advice that has been given to Tokbe, what, what is the benefit that, that we gain from the club? They don't respect us. They don't regard us with the supporters. Because of that, he spends money. They don't listen to us in terms of player recruitment. So we don't go to the stadium. So the money that he spent in the club, he's not getting it back whereby his company interest has been put in, but he should know we don't owe him because as a limited liability, we have shareholders and stakeholders. He doesn't listen to us. He holds his own AGM, imposes the board on us. Now we are fed up. He should go. If he's not going, we don't need the board there. And he should open up the uh, flotation of shares. We are ready to buy. If he's own, we can buy. People are ready to buy. If he knows he's a man, three years ago that went to the AGM, he was ready to what? Open up, but as of now, he has not opened it up. He should open up. He should not fear anybody. We are ready. We can buy his own. We can take it up. We know what he's doing, but I want to inform him and, and, and just let him know that Akabi is killing him slowly. <laughs>